So we are at Zhengjiajie, an amazing avatar mountain. For two days, we're gonna experience it together. Let's go. So today is the first day, we're just now getting the tickets and we're gonna head up with a cable car up to the top of the Avatar Mountains. This is gonna be awesome. Zheng Jiajie is placed in the Hunan province. It's about 2 hours and 40 minutes flight from Shanghai. We travel there with an agency called OK Deal Travel. Promotion code below. Exit and enter by the gift shop. Always a Chinese tourist attractions. With OK Deal Travel you get a local tour guide that will show you around. Ours was called Amy. Okay, so we can go for some pretty mountains later. We still have KFC there. And... <laughs> <laughs> Living the dream. <laughs> so, usually at these type of places like a gazillion of Chinese. It's actually not as many these days, but you have to be aware of sometimes it's queuing for the best Instagram spot. What? <laughs> 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 even have goats up here in the mountain. I don't know if they're dangerous or not, but let's try to pet them. The tour is two days, where you see several different spots and you travel with a bus in between the spots. So now the first real hiking is starting and you're walking on these kind of paved paths. So it's not, it's not super rough, it's not like walking in a mountain. It's pretty easy, it is super hot though, so bring a lot of water, sunscreen and of course the shade. Food choices are better at night, but during the day it's so so. It's lunchtime, and you can either do KFC or the local specialties up here in the mountains. So, the food options up in the mountains are so so, nothing against KFC, but come on, we needed something a little bit different. The coffee is really good though. Now back to the Avatar Mountains. Amy really shows the best spots to take pictures. Beware of the monkeys though. <laughs> There's quite a few people here. But look at this. I totally recommend you to go when it's not a public holiday, even though we went there when there was not a lot of people, according to Amy, it was still packed. Some mountain performance right there. It looks super scary. So now we're getting into the really old traditional with all these. Look at it, it's so beautiful and red. Amazing! And Piaoliangda. Look, it's so beautiful, but it's so many people here also, so you have to be a little bit careful. And if you look, look down there, it's super freaking steep. So beautiful, the really avatar mountains. Yeah, beautiful. 
So these red ribbons are following the whole path. That looks super beautiful. Look, it's everywhere. And what they mean is luck. You can buy them here for 5 RMB and it makes the whole path look super beautiful. Especially when you're walking around with this background. So we're just walking over a bridge that we didn't really realize how cool it looks. Look, look at this. So we were walking up there before. Okay, so now we've been hiking for about half an hour and this path totally is about one hour with this type of view. Super amazing. It is super hot though, so bring a lot of water and take it carefully because I'm dying of heat right now. into one of the tallest outside elevators in the world that we've been waiting for the whole day. It's gonna be super exciting to see. It's a little bit tight, but a really freaking cool view. Look at this. Okay, that was really cool. It went way faster than I thought it would be. But it looked really amazing. Hope I could show the same excitement as everybody felt in the elevator. Oi, oi, oi. So now we have finally come to the glass bridge and look at this. Isn't that amazing? Now we're gonna experience how it is to walk over 300 plus meters of glass. Are you afraid of heights? I am. camera that's why I'm using my small camera right now but it's incredible how scary it looks look at this this is really freaking scary really freaking scary 300 meters straight down and it's just this little glass that keeps me from not falling <laughs> I don't want to look down. <laughs> After about half an hour on the glass bridge, you go down to the Grand Canyon. Waiting for the next thing, you waiting for the best thing to come around. Forget about the stressing, can't you see it's now we're gonna go down from a slide. We're wearing these type of pants. Looking awesome, we're gonna slide down the whole thing. Down in the Grand Canyon, it's a 5 km walk along the water, which is super tropical and beautiful. This path is super cool, you have to like dive down. It's like walking in the rainforest. It's so freaking beautiful. 
Look at this. last stop of a two day tour. I totally recommend you to go with OK Deal Travel. It was a lot of fun. It's perfect to do over a weekend when you just want to get away from the big city.